we've just had the management's point of view. Let's take a sneak peek again into some insights of what the Gen Y talents within the company have to say about leadership, empowerment, sustaining talents within the company. The leader is a person that can make you do something and make you feel like you want to do it. And leadership is a person who can create unity and you can gain respect from what you have done. Take an example of a cart. A leader should be in front of the cart with the team pulling the cart, not on the cart and instructing the employees to move the cart. A role model that will walk the talk, that they're able to correct you and also at the same time able to show you your, your true potential. Be with the people to drive them and push them up. That's a leader. That person needs to feel appreciated for his or her contribution. And the second thing is to make sure that, that they are well rewarded. Not all of the employees are driven by monetary terms. Some of them remain in the company because they feel comfortable of doing so. And some of them would like to be in the company because the culture makes it totally different from other companies. We identified what the people's needs, identify the talents, what they need, then you can uh, incorporate that with your planning strategy, strategy plans. You have to make people happy, then people will want to stay. Some people, they need to know where they are heading and how long would they be doing that. And also, if you set some steps for them to climb, they know where they are now. Where would I be in two years to come, three years to come? How do I get there? So you would have to analyse the gap and bridge that. Improve the working culture in, in my company in future. I would like to revamp the Human Resource Department because I do believe that every, every single company do relies on the human capital inside it. Therefore, in order to build a very sustainable and very agile and strong company, it started with the employees. A part for them to relax. So, um, that helps whenever we feel stress, we, we cannot go anywhere. So we just go to the relaxing area, we use the pot and feel energized after that. And that's the first thing I want to do. If as a CEO, you are sitting in a management pos position, so probably you should groom one or two of the young executives to be sitting in that position. I will be focusing on people, developing them, making them feel that they are an asset to the company, and also to acknowledge uh, the contribution and um, at the same time, uh, realizing the full potential in them. I would like to do two things, which is to balance looking at the big picture as well as being very hands-on on projects and tasks.